What's good, gang? How's everybody doing? Lowering the volume a little bit. I'll lower it to like here, I think. Oh, that's muted. A little bit up. There we go. I think that's good. All right, I'll raise my mic volume a bit. All right. What's going on, everybody? Welcome in. How's everybody doing today? Started a little bit early. Look at me. I actually started a little bit early because I was sitting here and I was like, I think I'm going to talk for a little while. And I know everybody's always like, oh my God, can you get to the game already? So I feel like I thought it'd be best to start now. We'll start the game in like 10 minutes or so, I want to say. So if anybody wants to go grab a snack or something, go ahead. I'm just going to be talking uh, future plans, uh, recent drama that I've seen on Twitter and stuff and would like to just throw my opinion out on and stuff like that. How is everybody today? Happy Friday. My day's been hell. <laughs> and it's going to get worse after stream. So this is my happy time right now. I'm hoping stream goes good. I'm honestly thinking it might be better to just uninstall Twitter. Or only use my alt account. Evil Empire, thank you for the $5. Hey, Mortal Marcus, I really love your videos. And I hope that you have a good day and night. Love you, bro. I love you too. Thank you so much for the kind message and thank you so much for the super chat. I really, really appreciate it. Thank you. I really appreciate hearing that at the beginning of the stream. Oh, and now it's going to say it. Hey, Mortal Marcus, I really love your videos and I hope you have a good day and night. Love you, bro. I love you too. And Elliot with $5 can't stay today, but just wants to stop in and say hi and I hope you have a good stream. Thank you, Elliot. You know, I always appreciate you. Thank you so much for the $5. Um, Regardless of whatever you're doing, I hope you have a good time and I hope you have a good rest of your day as well. Um, got the this this whole thing right here. This whole thing is gone tomorrow morning. I decided like 10 minutes ago. You guys have started drawing it in the fan art and the fan like I, I saw I saw like one of them because my friends keep sending them to me too. They're like, this one looks really good. So I haven't seen all of them, but I've seen like three of them. Can't stay and away, I saw just wanted to stop in and say hi and I hope you have a good stream. Purple heart. Thank you again, Elliot. But um I saw someone uh drew it in the fan art and the fan art looks great. I just hate I hate this. I hate this. I was debating keeping it, I was debating not keeping it, and I decided today I'm getting rid of it. My only problem is that it doesn't grow like th this like what is that dude? Like it doesn't it doesn't even grow here. Like it's I don't even know what to call that. I feel like I look homeless. So this isn't bad, but it's it's just gotta go. It's I wanna I wanna get rid of all of it. <laughs> Johnny Depp is crazy. <laughs> hey big boy devilish face hello baller 12k thank you for the ten dollars <laughs> much much appreciated thank you thank you so much i might just start waiting for the super chats for the for the uh alert box to read it my god my acne's acting up too this is not good about to be a stressful weekend too uh so first i'm going to talk about the videos that are coming because oh good lord good lord man the Gemini Home Entertainment stream, right? I streamed it and I was like, oh, I'm going to edit it a little bit and I'm going to upload it for everybody to see. I can't do that. <laughs> I was watching it back and there was so much stuff that I just wanted to cut out and like, you know, shorten the length of it. So what I did was I just edited the whole thing like it was a regular YouTube video, which is a horrible idea because it's three hours of footage, but I'm 80% done, right? The video is going up tomorrow. And then, out of nowhere, Gemini Home Entertainment, for the first time in almost like two years or something, uploads a new video. I've been working on the video for what, three weeks? And in three weeks, out of like almost two years, Gemini Home Entertainment uploads a new video. Are you serious? So, basically what's gonna happen is that's... I hope you had a good day today. Thank you. Cheyenne, right? Right? It's Cheyenne. Please tell me I'm right. Please tell me I didn't mess that up again. But thank you so, so much. Oh my God. Hold on. I'm... What's good? What's good? Hello. Hi, Natalie. Thank you so much for the $2. I appreciate it. Thank you. Hope you had a good day today. Thank you. I, I, I appreciate it. I hope you had a good day too. Hello. 
I'm just making sure I'm not missing anything. Appreciate all the donos, guys. Seriously. Um, but man, so so uh, like I said, Gemini Home and upload a new video. So what the deal is is that I'm gonna upload all the videos. I think there was like 18 out at the time. I'm gonna upload all those in one gigantic video for you guys since it's almost done already. It's gonna be like around two hours long, a little longer than two hours. That's gonna go up tomorrow. And then, just if things couldn't get worse, not only do I have to finish out the two hour video and then now have to make another Gemini home video on the new video that they made, Vita Karnas announced that there's a new video tomorrow, which is gonna be the season finale I'm expecting it to be very crazy because it's the season finale and they've been working on it for a few months now, I believe. And it's Vita Karnas. It's the best video that we've ever uploaded. I think it's what I'm almost known for at this point was going over Vita Karnas. And that's coming out tomorrow. When I already scheduled the Gemini Home Entertainment video to come out tomorrow. So, basically, most likely you guys are getting two videos tomorrow. Gemini Home and the Vita Karnas finale. Because I'm not going to let these goofy copycats get ahead of me. <laughs> Throwing shade at a few people. Not any, of the ho not any of the homies, though. The homies are so respectful. I don't care about people that go over analog horror. But when you go over analog horror and you copy exactly what I say word for word and copy my thumbnail like you copy and pasted it, then we have a problem. Then I'm not friends with you. That's what gets you unfollowed on Twitter. Anyway. I have to catch up now. <laughs> it's me, Kiwi. To you. Thank you. Thank you for the $10 dono. I appreciate it. Needed need the hugs and kisses right now. <laughs> and Caitlin, I'm thank you for the, the channel, five. But just want to say love you and your vid smile making accordion potatoes, veggies, and steak as I watch this. Three, That's, keep it up. That sounds really good. I love, love steak. I would love some steak right now. Can, can you make me some? Can, can you do that? Can you send some over here? Yeah, I spoke about it on Twitter on my main account and then I deleted the tweet because I was like, I don't want to be that petty. But there has been cases where I've seen people copying exact thumbnails, copying word for word what I've said. Like, you want to have the same theory? You sure, that's fine. Correctly. Get enough sleep, okay. Very happy to hear Cheyenne. I'm happy to hear I pronounced it correctly. Also, Cheyenne, I saw you in chat before too. Missed you. I feel like it's been a minute since I've seen you. Um, but yeah, there's been youtubers that have been copying which is fine. Like it's really whatever I'm not gonna I don't want to show an example and call out anybody directly um, and send Unnecessary stuff, but you guys have actually told me about them I've seen it in my comment section a few times that people are like yo this guy's straight up copied and I was like wow That's kind of crazy and some some of them were people I knew um But like people like like I don't want it to get confused either like with people like um, Don or Pecan or Loud Flavor, they've also been going over the analog horror stuff. Same with Zach, of course. And um, they're completely fine. I love them to death. They have their own original thoughts and their own original thumbnails and everything, which I really appreciate. So, yeah, me and the mods have talked about it. I always send it to the mods. I'm like, look at this. This is ridiculous. Um,. But yeah, so there's that. So you're most likely getting two videos tomorrow. Uh, I, I just want to upload Vita Karnas right away because I know everybody's going to be on me about it. And then uh, after that, I'm going to upload the Gemini Home video. And then I'm expecting... I feel like the storm isn't over yet and that something else is going to come that I'm going to have to upload a video for. So I'm going to be a little editing monster this weekend starting tonight. So it'll be another late night for me. True, that is how you know you're doing good, which is really nice, but also drives me insane. When people did that on TikTok, it drove me nuts. Some people give credit, like some people are like, some people have done similar editing styles and they've given me credit in their description, which I really appreciate. That's fine if you're giving like some kind of credit, but just straight up copying and pasting is crazy. I did see Greylock did a video, uh, a new video two days ago. I saw it was only like two minutes long though, so I'm gonna wait before I do my analysis on it. I'm just gonna wait a little bit, cause I don't wanna, I don't wanna make a whole video for their two minute video. You know what I'm saying? Like I feel like I should wait till they make another long video. Which Greylock has been super consistent, so big shout out to uh, Rob for that. So. 
<laughs> True, we could turn two minutes into an hour on stream. Also, I would go over the Gemini home video today, but I'm gonna save it for a video. I, I, I know people were saying that I should go over it on stream. I'm just gonna save it for a video. It makes it a little more complicated doing it on stream because then I also want to edit it out. I don't want anybody to watch the reaction to this one before the actual Gemini home video is out. So also, yes, that is a new shelf. Um, it's got the, the somebody commented that I had Dragon Ball Z figure arts and I was very happy that somebody who actually uh, like noticed what they actually were. But uh, yeah, I collect Dragon Ball Z figure arts figures. I have a disease. Um, it's, it's an addiction. I literally have like seven pre-ordered that are coming from now till January. So that shelf will def definitely change up a lot. I also need to do another drawing on here because I don't even use this for like my to-do list anymore. I'm just drawing on there. Yeah, fig warts, they're, they're, they're so expensive, but they're literally like exactly like the show. It's my, it's my little nerd thing. Also, I watched the Spider-Man movie this, uh, when was that? Last weekend? I watched the Spider-Man movie on Sunday. Did I see you guys since then? Yeah, right? I streamed Monday, I think. I don't even remember. I don't know. This week's been a blur. But the Spider-Man movie was incredible. I highly suggest watching it if you're a Spider-Man fan. Even if you're not, it's a great, great movie. I'm not gonna spoil it, don't worry. But like, I'm a bit of a fan if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> oh yeah, the soundtrack is fire. I'm not sure if you guys saw that on the Instagram story. I was listening to the soundtrack. I love it. I don't even listen to rap and stuff like that anymore, but I definitely Metro went crazy on that soundtrack. Um, what else? Oh, <laughs> uh, the whole Twitch thing. Apparently, uh, it seems like Twitch redacted their statements of the whole ad thing that they took it back. I don't know if they're planning on releasing something again, but like a modified version. But apparently, for those that don't know, over on Twitch, they like b almost banned having ads on Twitch, like or banned sponsorships, I should say. Like they were saying, like if you had sponsorship logos on your stream, they had to be like three percent of your screen, which is like this big, which is laughable. They were saying, like, it can't be too big, which is a joke because Twitch Rivals uses logos bigger than that. Anyway, big bad move by Twitch. And then it's, they got shit on it so much that they basically went on Twitter and they were like, uh, we're sorry, we actually, we actually didn't mean that. So, and now there's the whole thing of everybody's like, we should go over to Kick, but also I am not a fan of Kick. You will never see me over on Kick unless YouTube somehow craps the bed and so does Twitch. Um, I'd rather go back to Twitch than go on Kick. The only reason I don't mess with Kick is because they platform Aiden Ross, who literally asks people to get stoned to death. And I think that is insane. And people want to complain about Twitch banning people. Abby, thank you for the $5. Much appreciated. Sore from volleyball, but your content is helping me recover. I hope you had a, I hope you had a good volleyball game. I hope you won. But I'm happy that the streams are helping you recover. Hope you're relaxing and enjoying right now. We're going to get into the game soon, which is another thing I have to talk about. Hey Marcus, how are you? I'm sore from volleyball, but your content is helping. And now it reads it. <laughs> Jabin, thank you for becoming a member. Happy five months. I appreciate you always, Jabin. Also, big shout out to the mods. The mods have been going through it today. Yeah, there's just so much I want to talk about. The mods have been going through it in the Discord. I'm letting you know right now, if you're like a troll or something in the Discord and you even make a joke that's like racist or homophobic or something, you're getting kicked out. I have no patience for it anymore. Before we used to give warnings and we used to be nice to people. That goes for a YouTube chat too. I don't mess with that. Any kind of hate Jane spread, you could get the hell out. I don't care if you're joking or oh, not. Wow, I'm famous. You are famous, Javid. Uh, but yeah, we're just banning people if you guys are straight up bad now. Like we had somebody come into the Discord today and they were like, Oh, I've been banned in the past for racism. Who joins a Discord and says that? Brock, what's going on, Brock? Thank you for the $2. Much appreciated. <laughs> Appreciate you as always, my friend. Uh, Cheyenne, if you're on the phone, you might not be able to see it, but if you're on um, if you're on YouTube on desktop, it should be near the subscribe button. It should say join. 
Yeah, I just it's at this point. It's like it's not even we used to entertain the trolls like you know what I mean Let them slide if it was like whatever and they stopped but at this point It's it's become so annoying. That's just you're gone in two seconds, uh -huh. dude. Oh, uh, yeah, here goes my money Again. Especially with the big um, influx of you guys since I made the uh, art channel. I mean the uh, the art contest thing So I just want to let everybody know that if you're a troll and you don't want to get banned just don't troll, please Please leave my mods alone. They go through it enough in their own day-to-day -day lives. They don't need you guys on top of it Kid what's going on? I see you in chat. I'm gonna do a monument mythos video I don't I think we're gonna do a monument mythos stream. I don't know if I could do an edit another two hour long edited video I might die <laughs> But we'll do a monument mythos stream in the future for sure. Maybe next week. Oh Yeah, yeah, he said he was banned 26 times. That is crazy. He said he was banned 26 times. Like, people are just so goofy. Alright, um... Oh, Evolucius, what's going on? Love you, Vince. Remember, take breaks. Keep the beard. <laughs> Alright, I'll think about keeping the beard a little longer. I'll think about it. I'll think about it. No promises, though. No promises. Uh, I, yeah, I, I think I'm gonna need, like, some kind of break. Like, a few days break after this weekend. So... I'm just gonna catch up on all my videos and then hopefully take a break for a little bit because everybody's been the analog horror community is going crazy right now love all the creators they're going nuts they've been doing so so good I nerds let's get this stream start to you Brock just because you asked we'll get into the game I'll start talking about the game now thank you for the two dollars by the way hey what's so the frog's head Pat Panda, I'll show you. Thank you for the five dollars, by the way. Hold on, guys, I'm wearing pajama pants. If you know me, this is a rarity. I usually wear jeans. This is a Cult of the Lamb hat signed by the devs. I got it at PAX, but I didn't know where to put it, and I was like, "Who am I gonna put it on? I'm gonna put it on my boy Peepo." You know what I'm saying? So he wears the hat now. It's actually been very safe over here on his head. I thought it was gonna fall off and get destroyed, but that's the first time I moved it since I put it on. Are the na is the alert box delayed now? Cause I saw another dono and it didn't go off. K-pop rhythm. Thank you for the seven dollars. Hope all is well. I really like your analog hard videos. Keep up the good work, homie. We talked a few times on Insta. I believe in you, Libby. Thank you, Libby. I appreciate you so so much. And thank you for the support as always and thank you for the seven dollars. It really it really does mean a lot You guys are you guys are going crazy right now. I appreciate all the support <laughs> Yeah, Abby anybody that says oh, I can't be racist just gotta get kicked out Hope all is well. I really like your analog horror video now it goes off Keep up the good work homie We talked a few times on insta. I believe in you Libby Feed the deep I'll look into it ducky Bro, ducky like duckington. I like your username racist. Um, all right, so the game So today's game is interesting chat We're finally getting get into it. I'm sorry. I talked for so long. I know some people hate that but I Like to get some things off my chest. You know what I'm saying? Um, so The game we're playing today is called the Grey Hill incident It's an alien horror game that I have seen on TikTok for the last seven months or something like that I believe it was made by the people who created Madison. So if you're over on Twitch and you saw that, that was the horror game with the camera. Really good horror game. Even though the ending, I believe, confused me. But really good horror game. And so I was very excited for this. Although the Steam reviews for this game, it came out today. I'm not looking hot. Crazy now to space. Thank you for becoming a member. Wait, was that gifted? Was that a gifted membership from Slimy? Shout out Slimy, thank you for the gifted membership, I appreciate it. And Brock, thank you for another dollar. Appreciate you always. Uh, but the Grey, <laughs> the Grey Hill incident uh, has mostly negative reviews with 100 reviews so far. That is terrifying, because I've been really looking forward to this game. So we have good news and bad news. Um, I'm going to play it anyway. <laughs> and, and we will decide as a community 
if the game deserves the mostly negative reviews. Apparently it's like a little over an hour of gameplay, which is kind of insane because I thought the demo was like an hour long. But I don't know, maybe I'm confused on that. But um, yeah, so we're going to play it. We're going to see how it is. It might actually be good. Sometimes I don't vibe with critics. Critics sometimes crap on movies and other games, and then I go and see them or play them myself, and I'm like, wow, this is really good. I don't know why they crapped on it. But um, we'll try it ourselves. We'll see how it is. The bad news is this game could be trash. The good news is that another alien horror game dropped today as well. <laughs> and it's actually by a creator who I've played games from before. Uh, again, Twitch people, I'm sorry, I'm going to keep referencing Twitch just because it's where I started and I'll, I played a ridiculous amount of horror games over there. Um, you guys re might remember Our Lady of Sorrow. Uh, you might remember Harmful, the first and second tape. Um, all three of these were pretty good. Our Lady of Sorrow was good, but it was a lot of religion, I believe. So you guys know, I, I have nothing against religion. I just don't know a lot about it. So <laughs> it's kind of confusing for me, but uh, it was still good. There was still good jump scares and stuff. The arcade files thank you for the two dollars i appreciate it thank you so so much but uh they uploaded incident at grove lake i love your content and my name is pronounced shay thank you for letting me know shay appreciate the two dollars and twenty cents and thank you for the support thank you for being here i really like the romeo series i hope i can see more of it keep it up love your content Bobby chulo 69 <laughs> Thank you so much for the $5. And I'm happy that you guys like the Vromia series. I was very, I actually almost didn't upload Vromia because I wasn't sure if people were going to like it. Super happy that I did because you guys love that series to death. That was, that was also why I made it two parts was because I was like, I don't know if people are going to like this, but I'm so happy that you guys enjoy it. And thank you. Thank you again for the dono. I appreciate it. Um, but yeah, so Incident Grove Lake also came out. It's another alien based horror game. It's 20 to 25 minutes. I love games that are that length because I feel like it's just enough, especially for this style. So we'll be playing that after, M most likely regardless whether this game is good or not. So uh, let's just jump in, I guess. I also think it's crazy that the game has mostly negative rev reviews and already has paid DLC, which is kind of insane. So I'm hoping that this game isn't as bad as I think it is. Um from what i've heard the problems of this game is is that it's too short people were expecting something longer than like two hours and that the objectives are hard to follow so we're going to try our best here oh no that's not good i also heard there were performance issues which hopefully we don't have to go through today we're going to lower these all to high just to be safe Okay, I think we're all good here. That's not a good sign. There are no audio settings. It's literally just subtitles on or off. Fat Panda, how'd you, how'd you fall off your chair? <laughs> And don't worry, Slimey, it's it's coming tomorrow. Gemini Home is coming tomorrow. And the new the newer video from Gemini Home will be out shortly after that. That is not good, dude. This game is by way too big of a team for it to be uh for there to be no audio setting like that. That's something I expect from an itchio game. <laughs> he is a fat panda. I love the username fat panda, I think it's funny. And thank you for the 10, of course. I just feel off my chair. I just feel off my chair. And Slimey, thank you for the two as well. All right. Oh no, we're lagging hard on stream, are we? Entertainment or else I sue you greater than. Am I? Are we lagging on stream or are we good? We are good. I'm doing a wave. Mildly. All right, hold on. Let's start the game because I know sometimes the menus are so high quality that they lag me a bit. This is not going good already, chat. <laughs> I'm nervous.
Mohammed, what's going on? Welcome in. Guys, can you hear me? My husband said he spotted someone or something next to our car again. I know this sounds weird, but he said it looked like an alien. But they ran into the cornfields and disappeared. I'm going to call the police. Amy, don't. I don't trust the cops or the government, or anyone else for that matter. And you shouldn't trust them either. We created our neighborhood watch for this exact reason. Brandon, I understand the situation, but this needs this to stop. This stream is about to be some it's fire action on my second monitor while I play Tears of the Brian Kingdom. Tonight. Mr. T, thank you for the five dollars. I appreciate it. Hope you're enjoying Tears anything. of the Kingdom. Otherwise, we all end up in the nut house. Are you trying to tell them we think there's little green men running around? Gray, Brandon. They are gray. The only thing we can do in our situation is to board up our windows and doors. I'll try to rest a bit. Uh, but Amy, trust me. You don't want to end up in the psych ward. I've paid a high price to break free. The only way to escape ah, was to... You've told your stupid story a thousand times. In Vietnam, we dealt with things worse than that almost every day. It's a long what does intro. Vietnam have to do with it? Whatever. I always wear my tinfoil hat when I leave my camper van. I believe the aliens have the ability to control us through telepathic powers. I'm convinced that the hat protects me. Hey, guys. Henry's been acting strange since he came home from the forest this morning. I don't know what's going on with him. Ryan! Hey, my kitty cat's also behaving really strangely. And she hasn't come home yet. Please, look for her during your shift. Dude, this is so long. <laughs> uh, Henry is more important right now. But if I find your cat, I'll let you know, Bob. Alright, I'll reach out to the other neighbors. I'll tell them to board up all their stuff. The fact is, our government is hiding something from the people. Things like this just don't happen here in Grey Hill. It started with Roswell, and it's been increasing since the 60s. That is the way it is. Are you and your bat ready for the night shift? Ryan Baker, the king of baseball. Yeah, Brandon. I can't do this anymore. I'm Don't done. Don't forget to visit us later, Ryan. We'll make some coffee. Oh, the cutscene ended anyway. <laughs> I was going to skip it. Um, yeah. Top bot. Sure. Thanks, Amy. I'll kiss it for you. Don't worry. Just for you. All right. How's the how how we look in chat? Game look good so far on stream. Kiss the alien. I'll kiss him. Don't worry. It looks good. How is it on stream? Good on stream. Good on stream. Looks fine. Intro is boring though, for sure. Uh, I'm gonna raise up the gamma a little bit a little dark a little too dark for me All right, uh Yeah, that that whole intro was yikes Shane has become a member I Appreciate you I see you did it on the second account like you said <laughs> Thank you so much. I don't know why it w isn't it doesn't show it on some accounts I'm gonna have to look into that cuz I know a lot of people don't see it for some reason. All right, uh, so our name is Ryan. Uh, it seems like there's been aliens spotted and we're gonna look into it. Hand crank flashlight. I think they work because of the crank function. However, the dynamo doesn't work. All right, uh, the abduction, a book. All right, so we got a lot of alien freaks going on here. Walkie talkie. All right, I can't pick any of this up. Yeah, I already, oh. Henry, tell me what you saw in the forest today. You should ask Rachel, that crazy girl. Henry, there's someone in your room. Is Rachel in there? God, I hope not. She should stop bothering me. What's going on with you, Henry? Tell me. Who's there? I'm going to your room, Henry. Stay here. Where's Henry's room? That sounded like it was coming from upstairs, yeah. Oh wait, this is the attic. This can't be his room. Ooh, got some trophies. Brandon's trophy. 
Vigo Dempsey, thank you for the dollar. Appreciate it. Thank you, my friend. Uh, yeah, no, that dialogue was hard to hear, and I sadly can't even fix that. Is this his room? Someone was in your room. They went out the window. Oh. You guys see anything? The light just turned off. Oh, dog barking. Max is barking. How do I? Oh, he's outside. Doggo. Max, stop barking. Who's there? Is someone in the shed? Let's find out. Hello? All right, I need to break the door. Uh, where, where do I find something to break the door? There's a light over here. Oh, here we go. Crowbar. That should help. I might fall asleep during stream, so if I don't answer, you know why. It's pretty <laughs> late for me. All good. I appreciate being here even though it's pretty late. Don't stay up too late, though. If you got to sleep, go ahead. Hello? Bro, there's nobody in here. Now I'm locked in? No, Max! Oh, the... How do I get over there? Max! 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 Ha, come on, man. How did my dog die already? It's only been like 10 minutes. Props to best boy, Max. <laughs> and Max is brave, yo. Sounds like the neighbors are boarding up their windows. I guess I should do the same. We should all do the same. Man. I hope this is over soon. What was that light? Hmm. Okay. I already got some problems. My dog just... What? I'm really not going to go after the dog? I mean, to be fair, right? I feel like it actually makes more sense to not go after the dog. But for a game, I kind of want to go after the dog. <laughs> like, bro. Also, I'm using this like crank flashlight, right? There's a lantern that is always on right there. <laughs> Why can't I use that? Dad, it wasn't Rachel, right? Yeah, he uh, locked the door and ran out of the roof. It's okay, he's gone now. It was a strange light. Look, the TV. It's working now. Sorry, bro. I'm going to sit in front of you. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Lunatics and conspiracy theorists claim to have seen a UFO. The minority tries to convince other people that the small green aliens are real. The government has checked into this incident and has announced that this UFO, fortunately, is just a weather balloon. Hmm. Sounds like something the government would say. Just a reflection on the lens of the camera. There is no reason to concern. And don't forget to be aware of the small green man in your backyard. Your Mr. Broker. Okay. I don't think weather balloons move that fast, but sure. That is not a weather balloon. I agree. The government is lying and they're trying to hide it from us. I have insomnia anyway, so I don't mind. They're already in Grey Hill. We can't talk about it to the police. They'll just lock us up in a psych ward. Dad, we need to get out of this cursed place. I hate this neighborhood hole. Ryan, are you there? I'll go talk to Brandon. Oh yeah, you're right. I should close the door, right? <laughs> I'd be smart. I... Oh, this is not my room. Um, God, 
I'm not sure if I'm being biased and just shitting on the game because I know that it's getting reviewed badly or if I genuinely just feel this way. I don't know, just the dialogue and the whole game setup seems so odd. Also, yeah, that's another thing that was in the reviews was that the dialogue does not match up to what the voice actors are saying. Like the, the spelling is horrible. I'm here. Ryan, something is wrong with Joe Parson, the farmer, you know? He called me a few minutes ago. He was very afraid. Then the radio connection became broken off by something. He is working on the field near your house. You must check immediately what happened to him. Okay, I'll go check on him. By the way, someone was in Henry's room. They escaped out the window. I almost caught them in our shed. But there was a strange blue light. I'm sure Pull yourself here. together. Have you seen the TV news? No one will help us. We're all boarding up our windows currently. I know how to shoot because of the Vietnam War, and you can handle the baseball bat. We will overcome this night and drive to our holiday home by tomorrow. Don't forget how I shot your son's hat off while wearing it when I was drunk at the barbecue last uh, summer. Brandon, imagine how you I can still have to pay for that. Sober. But leaving town tomorrow sounds like a good idea. I'll keep you updated. Over and out. <sighs> it's like a plot written by ChatGPT. <laughs> like. Uh, God, it just doesn't make sense to me. Like, let's not go after the dog, but someone was just in my house. Someone was... Excuse me, I'm trying to talk right now. Someone was just in my house, and now I'm going to leave Henry alone? Like... I'm leave. No, I'm going to close the door. I actually hear someone running. I'm guessing I have to follow these lights. Oh, cow! Okay, we're not going that way. Do not follow the lights. Go this way? Maybe I should turn around. Okay, we're not going that way either. What is... What are those flashing lights about? Is that not where I'm supposed to go? Yeah, I feel like I wouldn't be friends with somebody that almost shot my son. What's the flag that's making that noise? It's a little, it's almost like too cliche. Remember that time I almost shot your son's face? Yeah, like what? I also heard another complaint was that you could only run for like three seconds before you run out of breath for so long. Which I am now understanding why. Alright, he said I gotta check on the farmer that's working near the fields by me. What is with all these blinking lights? I would think that that would be like a, hey, come over here kind of thing, but... I'm late, what's happening, bro? That's a good question. Oh my god, can I run again? <laughs> you know, I'm kind of wondering if they give you such a low stamina bar so that you take longer to do the tasks so that you can't refund the game. It's a tactic I've seen before. Alright, so we, <laughs> we're not going that way. It's got to be this way. That, that whole yard is closed in. Oh, do I get in my car? All right. Uh, is that a ha hiding? Huh?
Like, how was I supposed to? Okay. All right. It's fine. It's fine. Hello, cows. Oh, oh my God. A lot of you are dead. Absolutely not. I don't think so. Damn it. Hey, Marcus, what's going on right now? Um, apparently there was aliens nearby and a lot of weird stuff is going on around our house. So we're just trying to look into it and see what's going on. But we're pretty confident that's aliens. Hello, Mr. Cow. Moo! Okay. Fine, don't talk to me. See if I care. Yeah, F in the chat for all the cows. Should I go over here? Mr. Farmer. Unknown object. I'm just not going to pick it up. Okay, not climbing up there. God, this flashlight's annoying. Bella Bowser, thank you for becoming a member. Much appreciated. Welcome to the gang. Uh, can I go this way? Doesn't seem like I can. Hello, more cows. Okay. I st All right, there we go. I can run again. And now I can't run. Like, this is crazy. Thanks, dude. You actually listen to the community. I try to, Orange Leaf. I try. Moo. Bella Bowser has become a member. Oh, who's in there? Like, can I? I'm really trying to give this a chance right now. Did I miss something over here? that noise dude <laughs> that I can't even replicate that that was so weird oh what is this wait hold on um mr. cat what the is this Bob's cat what the hell is on her head are you good, bro? Looks like Kitty. Oh, I oh. should bring her to his caravan. My Kitty. It's mine now. Can I go through here now? I can. Look at that, guys. Look at that. He already boarded up his door weeks ago. I'll have to try the dormer window on his roof. Really? I have to get to his roof to drop off the dang cat? And there's the ladder. There's no way I don't see something in the cornfield, right? Go in there, kitty. Oh. Hello? Oh, damn. This guy is an alien expert. They abducted me. So he's been abducted already? Oh, Jesus Christ. I thought that was you on my roof. Is this Kitty? My cat? 
Uh, yeah. It's something. Yeah. I caught her out in the field near the tractor. Oh, what does she have on her head? I don't know. It makes a strange noise. It sounds like electricity or something. Oh, and Bob. I had a strange encounter in my backyard. There was also some kind of weird electricity. I'll tell you about it later. Let's look at the cat on the table. I'll take a closer look. He actually seems pretty normal for a guy that was abducted by uh aliens. Where oh there looks like an implant. Shut up, cow! Ryan, I think they abducted Kitty. Alright, this is like just the the fact that I can't adjust the dialogue audio and make it louder is crazy. Experiments. By the way, have you boarded up your house? It's really dangerous and gray out these days. No, not yet. You should do it immediately. You need to wear a tinfoil hat. Your son Henry too. They go into your brains. My telepathy. Also, don't forget. Don't ever tell me. As Brandon said before, the government loves it. Now, take this preparation for your W. Marcus, he is officially my favorite yes. YouTube. Thank you, Orange Leaf. <laughs> I appreciate it. What did he say? Take this preparation for your walkie talkie? Tinfoil upgrade. Aliens can't intercept our walkie talkies when using it. Are you serious right now? What the hell is this? What? No, 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 something very bad is happening. What's wrong? Oh, what do we- Okay. Can I? All right, it said middle mouse button, did it not? I'm not crazy, right? Oh wait, you guys probably couldn't see it. Um, do I have to pick up the baseball bat, or do I just have it? Oh, it's right here. Sorry. Oh God, damn. Henry, can you hear me? Marcus, how is your day? Mine has been okay so far. Uh, mine's been okay too. Just trying to get through this game right now. Hope you're... Oh, yeah, you said your... You said your day has been okay too. Hey, okay is better than bad, right? What is this? Alien is... Alien in the cornfield saw this yesterday. He must report this to Brandon tomorrow. Hmm. He wrote a note to himself. I think he had Alzheimer's. Oh, poor guy. Uh. I think I heard the alien. I swear if one of them jumps at me, they're getting whacked. Yeah, I'm out. Open. Open. Something. Oh, 
Oh, nah. I don't have to go through the cornfield, right? Wait, now I don't want to go to the cornfield now. Now I'm kind of scared. I could just jump over this fence and I'll be home. Yeah, I'm going to have to go through the cornfield. I think I remember there being a fence through the cornfield. I just need to get around the side over there. Okay, I need to get around the silo. This is... Nah, ain't no way, right? So one more thing. Do you enjoy making analog horror videos? What? BTW. When I first saw you, it was an instant sub. W. I do enjoy making the analog horror videos. And um, I do appreciate you subbing. It means a lot. Thank you. And thank you again for another dono. What kind of useless ass cop? Bro? Huh? What? Huh? Expected alien invasion in Grey Hill on May 11th, 1992. Nah, so they knew? Why is there a secret vial of Grey Hill in a police car? This doesn't make any sense. Three bullets? Who is bro killing? No one. Is the cop hoping to get a headshot if he ran into an alien? Why? Wait. Should I go this way? Who lives here? Hello? Okay. Uh, okay. I think I'm going in the wrong direction. Thank you, game. <sighs> so did the cop get abducted out of his car? Like, I'm so confused. Are the aliens still over here? Oh, that the ship is just parked. My bad. <laughs> okay, then. Oh I my you god. Compile all your analog horror videos into one marathon. Also, your genuine reactions to the analog horror is just amazing. Orange, thank you for another $5. We'll see. We'll see. I don't know if I'll compile them into one video. I don't know if my computer can handle all that, to be honest, but we'll see. You never know. I shouldn't go that way. Okay, so am I going home? Did I just grab the gun? Is that all I was doing? Can I go to the ship? Can I go say what's up to the crew? I cannot. All right, back home it is. Oh, what the? F Bro? Bob, thank God, Henry. They have ducked it and using some sort of ray or beam right through the roof. And a squad car crashed back there. It's the game he called it. But the car's empty and the office is gone. Ryan, this is an absolute invasion. Do you know what that means? They'll abduct everyone in the village. Humans, animals, and every little insect. 
They'll take samples of everything, making experiments of everyone. This is an extraterrestrial investigation. This can't be our end. I don't want to end up as an alien experiment victim. They already cleaned your house, so I don't think they're going to come back. I've already started to board up your place. This will save us tonight. But Ryan, uh, we have a little problem. I used up all the nails. This morning, I brought all my nails to the creek lab. Mr. Creek put them on the table in their house. You have to go get them. It's the first house on the left. I think he boarded it all up. All right, I'll get him. You have to find we a way in. communicate by walkies from now on. I think the cat's going to be a snitch. Guys, there's an absolute alien invasion going on. They're going to try to abduct us and turn us to alien experiments, but I'm sitting outside on your stoop. Across the street from the ship. Anyway. W YouTuber. Marcus is better than Mr. Beast. Quick, test, test, test. <laughs> Thank you again, Orange Leaf. I appreciate it. Yeah, I can hear you. By the way, I found a gun in that crash squad car back there. Great. Let's hope I don't Being have to use it. And sneak around. It's dangerous if they hear the shots and see you. Also, avoid using the flashlight. The Greys could see it immediately. And take note. It's important that they don't follow you into a house. If they do, we're screwed. If it becomes dangerous, hide in a car, a trash can, or something else. Yeah, great. Trash cans. Brandon would love to see that. He has three bullets due to ammo demands rising. I guess. That's a little crazy, though. Why even carry a pistol at that point? Especially if he was pulling up to an alien invasion. What did he think was going to happen? Also, did they not play test this? Like, do you guys hear how many times the, the audio of the characters is, like, overlapping each other? It's not even, like, a natural overlap. It's like... It's like they just didn't play it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Good luck, Ryan. I'm All right. They told me how to shoot, how to hide, and what to do if an alien grabs me. So they got to be pulling up soon. Was this not the house I was supposed to go to? Was it, didn't they say first house on the left? Tell me I got to go into that window, bro. I'm so on edge. Oh, maybe this house? Damn it. <laughs> Marcus, should I be on a mission to be top dono? Orange Leaf, I'm not going to lie. I do appreciate the donos, but you don't have to. I appreciate you just being here, but they do mean a lot to me. Thank you. <laughs> are you guys getting a lot of ads? And are they skippable? They should be skippable. Maybe we will get more ammo soon. Okay, baseball bat does not work on every door. Okay. God, this game is such a bad lack of direction. Did he mean last house on the left? Is that what he meant? All right, I don't want to get stuck. I know I'm not supposed to go over that. Only Dino is for my fave YouTube. Good stream. <laughs> Thank you, Orange Leaf. Thank you again. 
All right, there's a light here, which means something's over here, right? Like something I can... Did I actually miss that just now? Okay. Proceed to crouch. Oh, nah! Oh, the alien just walked in the house. Did you see that? You think they know how to open doors? Goofy, 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 you thought, you would have thought, you would have thought, buddy. I have no ammo. Shit. Okay. Alright, so two, two, oh, hold up. Alright, so it takes two bullets to kill. These are the nails. Sheesh, I will go to left and right to Marcus, dude. <laughs> Thank you again, Orange Leaf. Thank you. I'm pretty sure his homie would have came at me if he heard me shoot. So, I gotta be alone now, right? Oh, what is this? Alien probe! Where do they plan on putting that, huh? <laughs> I'm actually scared. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Oh, bruh. I got the nails. It's time to ditch this joint. Guys, I'm scared. <laughs> I have to hit two headshots to kill. I think has dead. I agree. I think that alien is dead. Not alien got beef with Marcus Doss crazy we. Yeah, no, nah, they definitely gonna be on my ass now. I took one of them out. That's not good. See, that was just one of them. What happens if they try to jump me? What's good, bro? I'm back with the nails. Thank you. Uh, I'm here. Brandon, I'm here. Bro said I got some ammo and gave me two bullets. Okay, Ryan, go to Brandon. He needs your help. 
Do you think so? Meantime, I'll try to get my caravan working. They disabled all the cars in Grey Hill. Wonderful. Where is his house? <sighs> Guys, you don't want an alien lover. They'll probably eat you while you're sleeping. Or put something in you to experiment on you. Alright, he can't be talking about... This can't be his crib. It's gotta be on that same street. Marcus got ops now. That's crazy. Marcus to king. We do got ops. We do got ops. Hey, yo. Cryptid. <laughs> Sorry, that was the wrong thing to say. I apologize, mods. <laughs> Gonna get a lot of weird responses from what I said. This is painful. My son was abducted. Uh, my friends are dying. There's an alien invasion going on, but I'm going to walk. Oh, come on, bro. Hello? Can anyone hear me? Hello? Officer? Please, is Hello. someone there? I can hear you. My name is Ryan. Who is this? My name's Apone. Thank God you're here. Uh, I'm injured. Trapped in a barn. Jesus, what's that smell? Oh, so he got out of the car after he crashed. Who are you? In which barn? There's tons of them. It's got to be trapped in the barn near the. I'm not sure. I just, I just woke up here. I, I can't remember what happened before that. You said your name is Ryan, right? Bruh, Marcus yeah. I have to tell you something. He can't get jumps caught. The government. They they know everything. They, they knew the invasion was happening here. They're gonna cover it up. Like they always have. I'm sorry. I, I got here too late. This shit! Listen, Ryan, you have to get as much tinfoil as you can. At least five rolls. Hello? Hello? That was that cop that crashed his car. How does he know all of this? Where the hell am I gonna find all that foil? So what am I? <sighs> hmm. He said he just magically woke up in the barn. I don't know about that one. All right. So I can't. It won't let me go this way. Orange Leaf, thank you for another two dollars. Alright, I cannot go that way. <sighs> like, is this his house? How am I supposed to know where Brandon's house is? That was closed two seconds ago. Got an op on the streets. You think they're stupid? Like how how good do you think their uh their bot mechanics are?
walking around the house. It's literally on the other side of that wall. Ah yes, Marcus the Riz God. I'll support to Marcus. Yes. One roll. We got one. We got one, Chad. We got one. I'm spamming E! I'm spamming E! Bro's got me cornered! This is not fair! Oh my god. Oh my goodness! Open the door! Oh my god, I'm not reloaded. Oh my god, there's three of them. I'm getting jumped. I'm actually getting jumped. Oh yeah? Oh yeah, yeah, I know you like that. I know you like that. Reload, you goofy ass! Get off of me! You're not probing me today! It's not happening! <laughs> it sounds like they're licking you or something. <laughs> that noise where it's like... Like, I don't <laughs> That's like my best recreation of it. Alright, so they do come in the house eventually. They must hear me open the doors. I, I called it though, right? I was like, what's gonna happen when they jump me? I knew they was gonna jump me. Okay, that door's locked. His door's open. No way he's not going to come in here now. came for him low Marcus has plot armor though I know what's gonna happen I'm gonna walk out here and one of them's gonna grab me or maybe not okay we got another piece of tinfoil where can I hide I'm looking for hiding spots Three, three, that's three. Can, there, can you throw me a bone? Will there be a fourth in here? No, that would make my life. Are you pulling up or not? For some reason, I really want marshmallows. You should go get some marshmallows then if you have any. All right, where is... Where else am I supposed to look for these, uh, oh my god, I'm gonna have to go through the backyard, aren't I? I see. Oh! 
Oh my shit. I think I'm gonna have to fight him. You don't want the smoke, bro. Here they come. What's good, broski? Bow! Bow! Yeah, yeah, what now? What now? What now, buddy? What now, buddy? That's what I thought. Alright, now we're out of ammo. We're screwed. I don't know how many uh, bat hits it takes to kill him, but... Not good, not good. There must have been ammo in the houses and I just missed it. Marcus, would you do a 24-hour stream for us? Um, yes, but maybe later on in the future. I don't know about any time soon. No tinfoil in here. Right now, I'm... The hell? Thought the reflection was something. Right now, I'm very busy with, um... The other videos and stuff, but maybe in the future I'd like to. I want to do a subathon, but I'm not sure how I'd get that to work on uh on YouTube. Oh, tinfoil. One more, perhaps. It's got to be in the diner, right? I should collect more tinfoil first. Are you kidding? Where's the last piece of tinfoil? I know there's a third alien somewhere because we got jumped by three before. You guys think I missed in one of the houses? What do we think, chat? I had to have, right? Because it's like, it's kind of like a linear path. Marcus, I dare you to use one shot of her gun and bat. You know, that might not be a bad move. Once we get ammo again, I just... Thought I heard one. Like, whack him with the... Oh, there he is. I see him. Damn, it's got it. I feel like it's on the other side of the street. Please don't overwork yourself too much. Don't worry, no plans to no plans to overwork myself too much except for this weekend. But other than that, we are we should be good. Oh, oh, there we go. That should be enough. Perfect. I should check in on Amy. She has to be in the diner. Okay. Nice. Yeah, we'll, we'll shoot him with the gun and then we'll hit him with the bat once we get ammo again because right now I got nothing. I only got the bat. I meant use one shot of your gun then bat him down. Okay, here we go. Where's Amy? Amy. She should be here. Amy. We're in the barn in front of the diner. Okay, thank you, Amy. Appreciate that. No, there's is there nothing for me to get here? 
What is the whole point of this location? There's got to be something I can pick up. Ammo? Literally nothing. Okay, cool. Wonderful. Definitely getting jumped, right? Is that a church or a school? Alright, they're not there. They said a barn. Um... Amy? Oh. Hello! Ryan, thank God you're here. Are you okay? They look so goofy with the tinfoil no, hats. Nothing is okay! They abducted Henry. I have to find a way inside that UFO. Meanwhile, I've been trying to get to Brandon's house because he's in trouble too. We'll help you, Ryan. The cars don't drive anymore, but maybe this old biplane does. We could use the biplane to Marcus, get I dare you to say L every time you kill one of them in the <laughs> bag then. <laughs> also say USA after saying L. <laughs> we'll see, we'll see. The UFO. That seems like a long shot. But I guess it's our only option. But even if we do get close, how the hell are we gonna get inside of that thing? I don't know. Maybe Matt has a solution for that. He is on the farm to get some stuff. Can you tell him that the biplane is almost repaired? Alright. And by the way, that officer you called? They got him. They imprisoned him in a barn somewhere around town. I also found some odd documents about Greyhill in the squad car. I never call the police. Brandon forbid that. Yeah? But I thought you don't listen to our chief. Usually I don't listen to him. This time I did. But who called him then? I don't know. I'll go talk to Matt now. Ryan, oh my god. Is that it? Is that the end of the dialogue? Can I go now? I'm betting one of these doors is gonna open. Yep. Matt, is that you? I just don't understand, like... Oh, shit. That was a checkpoint. Like, some of them are so calm, and some of them aren't. Of course I do. God, it's so hard to- Ooh. Fuck. No! Hit him! Goofy? Use the bat! Oh my god. Why is the bat not working now? Okay. 
I'm gonna be honest, I actually don't know my PC build offhand. I have to like look through my settings to see. I used to know it, but then I changed so many parts and I don't even remember anymore. Five plane racing winner. All right, now nah, that's crazy. I don't know, chat. All right, uh, type one in chat if we should keep playing this game. Type two in chat if we should switch to the other game. I've not seen a single one. <laughs> oh, I see one one. Two ones. All right, two it is. It's uh, it's not horrible. Like the objectives are annoying that you don't know exactly where they are, but they you kind of know where they are. But the storyline, the voice acting, yeah, it's dragging. Yeah, I think that's a perfect way to describe it, Cole. It's dragging and there's just not enough substance. <laughs> like, there's not enough to keep me interested in going. Like, yeah, my son got abducted by aliens, but I don't I didn't really care for him to begin with. <laughs> like, he was so annoying, even from the start. And the characters, I'm just not, I don't know. The cop and Brandon are the only believable characters. And even Brandon was annoying. I was in Vietnam. All right, bro, I get it. Meanwhile, he probably died to aliens. All right. We're going to play this other alien horror game, which is called Incident at Grove Lake, which has a much more like, you know, PSX style. And uh, it's 20 to 25 minutes long. So hoping that it's good. Uh, it's made by a developer that I've played games from before, and he's made some pretty good stuff. So let's see. Yeah, we did try. We did try. We can't lie that we did try. And like the fact that like the, some of the controls just don't work like I was trying to hit that alien with the bat I couldn't hit him with the bat for whatever reason. I think um, middle mouse button to hit with a bat is kind of stupid Intended to be played in one sitting headphones recommended Such an interesting setting, sound off completely. All right. Let's see, incident at Grove Lake. Dan McGrath. Repent of your sins and turn to God for the kingdom of heaven is near. No, no, not you. Has become a member. Not you. Not immortal fans. No, you've made your way over to YouTube. Damn it. Thank you for becoming a member, immortal fans. I'll explain immortal fans in a second. September 6, 1997. We got a sketchy black car pulling up. Oh, are we in Area 51? Kinda looks like that, right? Big desert? <laughs> dot 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 dot. Initializing scan. <laughs> ah! Okay. <laughs> Triangulating targeted Position. Connecting to live footage, connecting to live audio. Connected. Marcus, in another stream or this stream possibly, can you play SCP Containment Breach? I can walk you through the basics and it's pretty fun. I've actually already played SCP Containment Breach. I want to play it again at some point, but we're not going to do it today. In the future, though. Target, appreciate you taking my call.
Oh, I'm supposed to click. Let's get this straight. You got out unnoticed? Medical discharge. They think I have kidney stones. Huh. Not so smart as they think at S4, huh? Smarter than you know. So can we meet? Sure. Let's make it a public place. Remember, I don't have a lot of time. Neither do I. Let's say the diner on... Or... Works for me. I'll bring what I found. Good. I'll see you soon. Remember what I have risks... Remember what I have risks for, for this. I remember. Line disconnected. Okay, so we got two sketchy people trying to meet up. I've not heard of SCP-5K, I don't believe. Somewhere north of Nevada. September 9th, 1997. On the topic of SCP, have you heard of SCP-5K? All right, we're in. Praying there's a pause menu? There is, thank God. Okay. Um, Here, yeah, I'll explain real quick. So, Immortal Fans... Um, is a or was an account on twitch that followed uh my stream right and immortal fans you know used to chime in here and there but immortal fans has an instagram account where they make some pretty interesting posts about me if you're interested i said just looking up immortal fans on instagram let me just make sure that's their username i believe it's just immortal fans right yeah it's immortal dot fans is the instagram account name by the way, Mortal Fans, if you could change your bio to the YouTube link, I'd appreciate it. Uh, but they've made a lot of questionable posts. Um, whenever they appear, usually a post appears too. Uh, but yeah, they've been making posts since... Oh, over a year now. April 2nd, 2022. So... Also, uh, don't forget to follow me on Instagram too, you know, Immortal Marcus. You know, appreciate it. I post stuff, kind of. <laughs> I gotta do another like actual post soon. I post on my story a lot though. All right, here we go. Who's that sketchy person? Is that just a random person on the street? I believe I'm the character that's gonna meet at the diner. Thank you, Immortal fans. Appreciate it. Alright, those are just random people on the street. Okay, cool. I see the diner. Uh, there's a few people in here. Let's see. Uh, am I supposed to be meeting you? Guess not. It's gotta be you then. Oh, it's definitely you. Thank you for coming. I didn't know who else to tell. I've risked so much getting here. They're following me. I don't have much time. Please take these. Some files and just one of many tapes they have. Get this stuff to the public. They need to know but before it's too late. If I don't hear from you by the 11th, I'm going public with this. There's a radio station I know of, you know? Please go and be careful. They'll follow you too. Alright, my theory is that this guy was... Abducted by aliens or something. Or maybe was in Area 51 and somehow escaped. That's my theory. September 10th, 1997. Right, we got the oh we're gonna play the tape what's on this tape huh what does the public have to see the following tape is property of the united states government incident 17 example of encounter type f 
copying or distribution of this tape is strictly prohibited classification of this content is reserved to members with ts sci clearance the following took place august 19th to 21st 1997 grove lake redacted the tape was discovered and handed to local authorities please contact your facility supervisor on conclusion of this tape as outlined in section 4b paragraph 8 for cycle blah, 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 blah. Yeah, how did this guy wait a day to watch it? Like, we're on a time limit here. <laughs> Alright, we're playing as the tape. I like that. So we're just taking a walk around Grove Lake, I guess. Big clearing. Got some rocks. More rocks. Come on. Okay. Oh, we're camping. This is a camping tape. Uh, oh, did, so was that just a glitch in the footage? Lake, this way. Okay. To the lake. Yeah, people always get abducted in a campsite or a forest or something. <laughs> that didn't scare me. Not at all. Not even close. Hmm. Starting to notice some dead trees here and there. Just a little odd. Oh. talking about a UFO that was in the sky. It sounds like a police radio. Why would somebody randomly camping be listening to police radio? Please turn supplied handbook to page 42. We will now review the four types of encounters. The first kind, CE-1. Visual sightings of an unidentified flying object seemingly less than 500 feet away that show an appreciable angular extension and considerable detail. Okay. The second kind, CE2, a UFO event with physical effect, such as interference, animal reactions, or physical trace like impressions in the ground, scorched or otherwise affected vegetation, or a chemical trace. Okay. So first one's like visual, like you just see like an alien ship. Second one is the alien ship caused something to happen, but you didn't see the ship. It's like a, yeah. Okay. Hello, taunts. Oh, click. Sorry. The 
the third kind. UFO encounters in which an animated entity is present. These include humanoids, robots, and humans who seem to be occupants or pilots of UFO. Okay. What's the fourth type? A close encounter of the fourth kind is a UFO event in which a human is abducted by a UFO or its occupants. I hope we get a fourth type. The following is an, is an, is an example of CE2. Okay, so... Okay, I see the light in the sky. Whoa, whoa. Okay. Oh, I'm playing again. Did you hear that? Nah, that is... Nah, what is going on? I want to see what's doing all that. That does not look like what I thought we were going to see. Oh. Alright, we going into the house. We going into the house. Oh, nah. Please tell me I'm going to be able to play in the ship. We're in the ship! Ugh. It's wet. Hello? Oh, no, nah. is that what's going to happen to me? Oh, there's another path. So, is the ship itself the alien? Hey, yo. <laughs> These poor people. Are you good, bro? Are you alive? Alright, nah, they, they definitely not alive. No, 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 what's happening? Why am I naked? Why am I naked? Put my clothes back on.
The tape has now concluded. No further footage is recoverable. Tape will be added to archive section 4. Please now contact your facility supervisor for psychoanalysts and debrief. You'll be signing and completing form 52 up. Your discretion is a matter of national security. Please re remember your oath and those who came before you. Please eject tape now. Are we going to get the tape to the public or? Oh, that car definitely pulled up to my apartment. That's the F. FBI. Nah. <laughs> On September 11, 1997, talk show host Art Bell receives a fanatic, frantic call from a man. Online, you're on the air. Hello. Hello, Art. Yes. Hi. Um, I, I, I. I this man claimed to work at Area 51. Um, well, look, let's begin yeah. by finding out whether you're using this line properly or not. Uh, area, area 51. Yeah, um, that's right. Were you an employee or are you now? Uh, I, a former employee. Former um, employee. I, I, I was let go on a medical discharge about I a week ago. I think this is real. And, like this, this part. And, <laughs> I, I've kind of been running a, across the country. Um, oh, man, I don't know where to start. There are... Uh, they're, they're gonna, um, they'll triangulate on this position really, really soon. Um, well, you can't spend a lot of time on the phone, so give us something quick. Okay, um, um, okay, what, what we're thinking of as, as aliens are, they're, uh, they're, they're extra dimensional beings that an earlier precursor of the, um, space program made contact with. Uh, they, they are not what they claim to be, uh, they have infiltrated a lot of, uh, uh, a lot of aspects of, of, of the military establishment, particularly the Area 51. Uh, the, the disasters that are coming, they, the, the military, I'm sorry, the, the government knows about them. And there's a lot of safe areas in this world that they could begin moving the population to now, Art. But they're not doing, they're not doing anything. They are not. They want the major population centers wiped out so that the, the few that are left will be more easily controllable. Discharge. <laughs> <laughs> I, I started getting That was fucking fantastic. Just the just that ending twist where they tied it to something that actually happened and like the whole game was based around that, like down to the dates and everything. That was really good. I like that. 
I like that they did that like that. That was really cool. Would I have liked more? Yes, but it. I could tell you. You could tell it's one of those games where it's supposed to be a. It's supposed to be a shorter, you know, a shorter concept. Because the whole thing was that like this guy had this tape and he was like, you have to, you have to release this tape to the public. And if you don't, I'm gonna speak out to the public in two days. Obviously, we saw the guy that had the tape ends up getting caught. He doesn't release it to the public in time. So the original guy calls up and that call happens and that was a real call i that uh what what was the what would they say the radio's name was again hold on I, I bet i could find it on youtube somewhere hold on uh area 51 worker calls Yeah, because I could have sworn I've heard that audio before. I forget what they said the name of the, the, the show was. Was it Howard Stern? I thought it was something else. Unless maybe he changed the name so that it wasn't... So that it wasn't close. Hold on. I can't see it. I see, I see the FBI's in chat. <laughs> if I get a knock on my door and the stream ends suddenly, you guys know what happened. The FBI's on to us. No, that was fire. I really like that. I thought that was great. That's all that totally that that alone I liked better than Grey Hill to be honest. Something about short games gets me, man. I think it's just because the story is like short, it's straight to the point, it's simple. I, I don't know what it is, but it's so much it's I don't know, that was just a lot cleaner. I like that a lot better. Should we just look up the Grey Hill ending? Just to watch it. Because I kind of want to see how it ends, but I don't really want to play. Oh my god, guys, look! I'm the third on the list for the Great Incident if you look it up on YouTube. Carpet. But again, I didn't probe him. Didn't probe him. All right, this is who's you, hold on. Whose YouTube video is this? Fooster, F O O S T E R. Dropped this video uh -huh. yesterday. Where do we put it down? I just want to see how it ends. <laughs> if you couldn't hear that, looks like you got the car focus. working. Oh wait. Wait, what? We're on a table, aren't we? Henry. Oh, it's right here. Oh. This isn't working. Henry. Henry. Hold on, Immortal fans, don't worry, I'm getting to it. We're on a it. table, aren't we? Oh, no way does it end like that! Is that Max? <laughs> yep, things seem to have worked out pretty good for Rachel and me. Uh, I hate that we don't know what happened on the UFO to Ryan and the others, but well, after Ryan was abducted, his dog Max came along, and together we're now on our way to meet this mysterious man. 
I mean, that was the Greyhill incident. Time for a new book, yeah? God, I hope I'll find a publisher this time. Ah, look at me. Rambling again. Well, I hope you folks enjoyed yourself. Catch you on later down the road. Hey, Rachel. What was your favorite part about the story of Greyhill? Bob? Who are you just talking to? I think I would have lost my shit if the game ended like that. You get abducted and you just don't know what happens to your character or his son. That's crazy. That's... That's insane. Did Immortal fans post? Is that what this notification is? Or did you... Did you post or did you... You did post. What the fuck is that? Hold on, I'm pulling up Immortal fans' post. How do I search on... On Instagram on the website? Okay, there we go, I found it. Oh. My. God. Well, it's been so long since I've last been on here. Happy to be back and happy to see Marcus grow. Love this Instagram story he posted just today. I had to repost it so I can keep it safe. See y'all on YouTube. Hashtag gaming, hashtag immortal Marcus, hashtag K-pop, hashtag horror games, hashtag streamer, hashtag cap boy hashtag immortal babies hashtag made hashtag immortal bay hashtag youtube hashtag 2050 if i look like this when i'm 50 i hope i'm dead <laughs> if my forehead wasn't big enough <laughs> might as well just go bald at that point jesus christ Thank you, Immortal fans, for contributing, as always, to uh, to the fan base. <sighs> Hold on, I gotta look at my original story to compare. You actually photoshopped a smile on me, which is the craziest part. You photoshopped a smile- Alright, my forehead did look really big in this photo. Even I thought that before I posted. I was like, wow, my forehead is booming there. But... Damn. Thank you, Immortal fans. One day I'll... F oh, and that's the other thing too, chat, is that we don't know who Immortal fans is, and that is my mission is to find out who it is. I have my theories, but um, I don't disclose them because I don't want Immortal fans to know if I'm getting close or not. But, uh, yeah, damn. Isaac, you're late. I'm literally ending stream soon. <laughs> now, nah, what they did... I think the filter just automatically, like, just cut all the... My, like, I guess this front part out so it just made my hair look bigger it de please don't you know what i don't even want to talk about it <laughs> we're done we're done we're done enough enough all right guys i hope you enjoyed the stream today uh it was shorter than expected i'm sorry that the gray hill incident wasn't as good as it was i hope you guys enjoyed the other alien horror game though i definitely thought that was good especially with the way it ended i did enjoy that um but yeah Next, uh, tomorrow, Gemini Home Entertainment's dropping, and also my analysis of the final Vita Carnis video of the season, the Vita Carnis Season 1 finale, will be dropping tomorrow as well. So two videos, back to back. Please, t if you see them, comment on them, like them, watch them, please. <laughs> it helps the algorithm. Please like the stream as well if you haven't already, if you're here. Um, we got the stream to 200 likes. You guys are awesome for that. Um... 
but yeah so two videos tomorrow most likely the third gemini home video which will be i mean the the second gemini home video um which is based on the new video they just dropped will be out shortly after but um thank you guys so much for your support today uh thank you for all the donos and everything orange leaf thank you for your insane amount of donos same with mr t uh, thank you guys so much for all the support today for real you guys are the best oh my god you guys got, you guys jumped up the likes to 224 thank you guys uh, don't forget to join the Discord if you haven't already. We're also having an art contest right now. Uh, we're doing a fan art contest. All you have to do is draw me. No NSFW, no animations or anything. It's just got to be me. You can draw it by hands, on digital, whatever. Uh, but you join the Discord and you upload it there. You have until July 2nd, I believe, is the day I said that it'll end. So make sure to go do that. If you guys also want to check out the fan art, just join the Discord. There is a whole channel where you can look at it. Just don't talk in the channel. It's only for the uploads, please. And uh, if you do join the Discord, please be nice and courteous and do not spread any hate or else I'll ban you. And I don't really give a single crap who you are, what you've done. You will get banned if you show any kind of hate there. So just letting you guys know. But uh, thank you guys so much for your support today. You guys are awesome. I hope you enjoyed the stream regardless of Grey Hill Incident being meh. Uh, you'll see more videos this weekend. Next stream, I'm not sure. Maybe Monday, but we'll see. We'll see how I feel after this weekend keep you guys updated love you guys peace